This is a basic tutorial for the Sign Master Cut. Uh, so you're going to go ahead and start a new project, do File Import, and navigate to where your picture is. I'm going to use the Inspired Spine logo. So right here, you can drag it, enlarge it, and change it in a variety of ways. I'm going to leave it unchanged because I think the logo looks great. Uh, so I'm going to duplicate it a couple times just to get max usage out of the paper and so that you don't have to realign to uh, kind of cut around smarty cut paper on the vinyl cutter. So once we got that done, go ahead and hit the apple at the top and start the contour cut wizard. And you get a variety of options right here. We'll go ahead and hit next. And then at this page, hit yes. So here you're going to build out the tracing. So we're going to do the min to uh, anything at six or below. We'll cut everything for the logo. Then smoothing will change the edges a little bit. As you can see, everything has a blue line around it. So that is where it will cut. Uh, and then here you can change some additional settings. Uh, so this will change how some of the edges look. And then this right here will either uh, kind of create a bubble effect, or if you do negative, it will cut into the shape just slightly. And you can see how that works on the picture before you cut. So just go ahead and hit next. And then you'll see where it will cut on re in relation to the paper. And go ahead and hit cut. So for this, change the alignment method to none. And now it will ask you to position the cutter to where that uh, blinking target is in the picture. And right here, it will uh, you move it about one inch to the edge of the paper diagonally. And then um, in this picture, it will move up about a couple inches and then about an inch to the side and that is where it will begin cutting so just remember that for when you're lining up the cutter and now i will show you how to line up the cutter this is how to move and position the cutter for the side master cutting process so first you're going to want to hit offline and pause it's the second button up and down will move the paper forward or backward and left to right, we'll move the cutter. So if we want to cut our design, I'll put the cutter roughly about right here and it'll start cutting about an inch diagonally. So when you got the cutter in the right position, hit origin and it will be saved. So now you can go back into the Sign Master uh, program and then begin the cut. Okay, there's a second window.